I wouldn't be going out in the bushes punching trees. They've definitely got the body for it. You want to start boxing, you know, you'll get hurt. I'm Jai Pattaya, the IBF and Ring Magazine Cruiserweight World Champion. Some of these uh, training videos bring back some bad memories, you know, because <laughs> yeah, uh, it's one of those things, you know, you're doing things that you hate for those results that you need. You know, the long runs, the, the ice baths, there's a video of him doing the ice bath. You know, I'd rather do a two hour session than sit in the ice bath. But it's very important for that uh, body recovery and uh, you definitely feel the difference. That's just hard training, you know? It's that uh, resistance while you're trying to do those sprints. Like I do a lot of sled pushes and you know, like I've had Mark Maffey, my strength and conditioner, holding a band while I'm running against him. But as far as tying myself to a plane and like running with that, I, I haven't done that, but um, I'll give it a go. <laughs> I feel like the hardest opponent you ever have is the one that looks back at you in the mirror, you know? It's that, you know, fighting those demons mentally. You just gotta motivate yourself and get it done. And I feel like that's what they're trying to reflect in the movie, so it's, it's good. They've definitely got the body for it. I don't know how I'd go with all that muscle that we've had, you know, it looks good. <laughs> I've been in the boxing game for that long that all that muscle stuff means nothing. That power could get you far, but that boxing ability will get you even further. As far as um, knocking each other out of sparring, hey, it is what it is, you know? <laughs> we gotta, we got to push each other and train hard. It's not a game. You want to start boxing, you know, you'll get hurt, so you got to be switched on. I'm coming for everything. You threatening me? The emotion thing's a big thing in the fight game. Letting your emotions sort of control the way you fight. Just the fact that they knew each other as kids and, you know, they probably trained together when they were younger and now, you know, going into a fight as older guys, not seeing eye to eye, I can think of that in, in real scenarios, even just training with people I've grown up with and then fighting them down the track. But, you know, you got to learn how to control your emotions. I don't think there's any feeling like it, to be honest, they like walking out, especially when I walked out for the world title, for dreams are made off, bro. <laughs> walking out to a stadium like that, they'd be pumped ready for war, but the slightest little shortcuts throughout their camp, walking out to that ring, that's where they're gonna feel it. The nerves are gonna kick in. They're gonna start second guessing themselves. That's where your preparation's gotta be on point so you can walk out ready for any situation. I feel like the best things about these creeds with the fight scene is he's not always winning. He's getting knocked down, he's getting back up, he's getting knocked down, he's getting back up. By the end of the fight, his face is all battered and swollen and they just keep pushing forward. They're just giving up's not an option and I feel like that's what the main sort of message in those fights is. Compared to the old school movies as well, you can tell that these guys have actually done some boxing training so they are working on you know, their, their specific techniques and skills. Creed 3 looks mad, it looks like an awesome movie and uh, I'm definitely gonna go watch it in the cinemas.